Welcome to the Hydraulic Press channel. Today we have new interesting concept. We are going to crush things underwater. And the setup is pretty simple. I have just this plastic container inside of the press. Then some lights and the camera. And first we are going to film with our FX3, like regular camera. We can do like semi slow motion with this, 100 frames per second. And then I'm going to also try out with the high speed camera because we have 600 watts of light here available. So should be pretty nice. And first thing, Pepsi can. And here we go. I go pretty slowly. Okay, that didn't burst towards the camera, so I want to do one more can. This time high speed. Okay, and here is the high speed, and I have to say that I'm really pleased with the picture quality. I updated the high speed camera, and it looks much better now. This was a bit uh, challenging uh, filming situation, because it's like a smoke colored plastic. But yeah, the high speed is really nice. And then the next one. Okay, and then the next one. And I think this is going to be the best one. Glass Coca-Cola bottle. The glass is going to explode more violently than the aluminum can did. And then the cola is like dark, so you can see how the fluids mix. And here we go. Okay, that was interesting. There's only the neck of the bottle. Let's go all the way. Okay, I think I have to do that also in a super slow motion. Okay, here we go, new bottle, boom, and this time the whole thing broke, which is nice. And I can only fit one camera at the time, so only high speed from this, this bottle. Okay, and then the next one, now we have plastic bottle full of air. Okay, that was a bit boring. I have to do that again and leave the cap out. Okay, I remembered that if you try to explore these bottles with full of air, they don't explode so nicely as with some water in. So this is half full or half empty. Depends how you look on the life. No. Okay, now it worked. Okay, as you can see, I don't want to give up. Because these bottles should stretch really nicely. And I want to get it underwater. So now almost full. Let's see. Okay, now it works. Yes. Nice. That was actually super interesting because there is water inside and outside of the plastic. It doesn't like paint light in the same way, so the bottle was really hard to see, at least on my small camera screen on the end. 
and here we go again with the high speed camera 1000 frames per second and you can nicely see how the whole like container flexes when it explodes yeah so that was all of the underwater mayhem for today's video and I'm going to leave the setup here and film more on the next week so please comment down in below what you want to see underwater and it can be even like exploded stuff like CO2 cart dick des or stuff like that I am uh, limited on the like force up to 40 tons because uh, I can't mess up with the water so much with the big press here I have train on the workshop with the smaller press so this works much better yeah but that is all for today thank you for watching and have a nice day